everybody, my name is Edson, and welcome back to a brand new episode on the Timeshed SMP. Today, we're going to be working on a few things and stuff, uh, mainly things, but also stuff. And, yes, I finally decided what we're going to do for the floor. Um, I need to also update you guys on, uh, this is not the final thing. You, you'll see, you'll see, just bear with me. Um, so, I started... With the one pick that I had, I put Unbreaking and Efficiency 5 on. Then I went to put Fortune and Mending on. And because the Fortune and Mending... No, because the Fortune book also had... I think it was Fire Aspect on it. It was costing more to add on to... The, it was costing like 37 levels to add it to the, the pick. It was costing 33 to add the Mending book to it. Um, so I combined them both for 10 and I was like, maybe that might work. And then it was too expensive. So, I made another pick out of the few diamonds that we've got left. You guys will see here. We've got 21 now. We had 24. And I just put Fortune and Mending, the book that I just combined, onto the pick. Because that, obviously, if I'm only using that on ores, it will never break. It's just, obviously, I can't break the ores as quick. So, technically, that's not too bad. So, I'm going to just keep that for ores. We're going to probably do a mining trip later on. Um, I kind of want to get Silk Touch. Um, and slap that on this bad boy so I can just mine up all of the, the silk touch box. I don't really know. We'll see. We'll see what we're going to do. Um, I kind of want to, rather than go, I don't even know if I want to go strip mining in, this, in the uh, mindless mine or if I want to actually try and find a new cave somewhere in the world. I'm not entirely sure. We'll figure it out. But that's not what I want to start with today. What I want to do is I want to head to. So. This you'll see what it's going to look like later on, but this is the this is the start of it, um, and I can't really I can't really tell like I the only way I could show you guys is by sort of showing you the I don't even have a picture that's the thing I showed people on my live stream, um someone basically uh car star um someone from my a patron of mine one of my Twitch mods he helps run the the patreon server as well on his server he dug out um at the very bottom le like the the bedrock le level of of his world um like he built like a massive cathedral thing and he basically dug out dug out uh like to the very bottom layer and obviously it's it's like a random pattern um of like bedrock that like it's like spiky it looks spiky basically and he basically dug out all the blocks apart from the bedrock and then just like added like glass over it. And I kind of want to emulate that, but with obsidian. So that's what we're trying to do. Um, right. So I think I need to, I need to head to, uh, if we head to where I'm actually digging, because you'll see where I'm digging it out. Um, I've actually stolen, I hope it's still there because it's been like two or three days. I hope no one's taking it back. It was the re like resistance beacon at spawn. Um, so yeah, that's, that's what I took just for now. Just because like, obviously I've got efficiency five, but this makes it a hell of a lot quicker if we have haste two. So I've set up a beacon in the end, um, next to some of the obsidian pillars. And I'm just basically mining out some of the obsidian pillars. I've worked out, I think that was like three, maybe f three and a bit stacks that we've used so far. So we need like four stacks plus probably another, f I'm going to go for like six stacks. No, maybe. Let's dig out the rest of this pillar and then we'll see what, like, did we dig out the whole of a pillar? Or did we only dig out, like, part of a pillar? I can't really remember. What did we dig out? Let me head back up there and see what I've actually dug out. I need some blocks, though. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to dig out, uh, I'm going to dig out one of these pillars probably completely. See how many stacks we've got. I kind of want eight stacks, but I feel like that may be a while. We'll see. Um, so I'm just going to mine up loads of obsidian enough to hopefully finish the floor and you guys will jump me back when that's done or the floor is done. One or the other. We'll see. BRB. All right. So we are back and I have drastically underestimated how, how much obsidian I actually needed. I think, I can't remember how many I said, but like, this is like 12, four, I think it's like 14 to 16 stacks of obsidian right here. Uh, it's ridiculous amounts. Um, and I couldn't really get it all done. Uh, I can, I'm can. i going to go off and do more now. Uh, but I just want to give you guys a bit of a progress update. I need probably another three, four stacks for this bit. And then 
I need to obviously do what I've done here, but like round the whole thing. So as you guys can see, um, hmm, I don't know if this is the best idea. You can see the the thing around there. I suppose that's better if we have end stone round there rather than the cobblestone, because that's what I've used for like the sides of the obsidian. Yeah, we'll keep it as that. Um, so, as you guys can probably see, this bit is actually done. This is what I want the actual thing to look like. So it's a very random pattern, and it's very sort of like, I don't know, mismatchy. Um, and it's sort of like, it's essentially what the bottom of Minecraft actually looks like, the bottom of the earth, if you'd hollowed it all out. It's like very spiky, obviously it'd be a bit more sort of a bit higher layers there'd be more than just obviously two layers there'd be like three or four layers of like spiky end stone and i tried to emulate that and obviously put glass over it and it creates kind of like a weird unique texture and hopefully this is a bit better for people because the, the colors was nice black over the like the dark purple but hopefully this is like a little bit better for people that don't like to look into their imminent death <laughs> while they uh, enchant all of their armor boop um so yeah that's uh that's that i think next probably what i need to do is hmm what do i need to do next what do i need to do next i mean i could finish this obsidian bit then possibly i think the cow farm so obsidian oh, i don't really know how i'm gonna build them off here are we going to have like under layers like that? Or is this just going to be the center and then off here it's just going to be... I think off here it's just going to be like normal blocks as the floor. So we don't need to like go underneath sort of thing. That will be a lot easier and quicker. And it will still look quite nice. So um, you guys will join me back when the obsidian is done. And hopefully maybe the cow farm? I'm unsure. Let's do it. Alright, I am back. And I've finished the obsidian floor. It took so long. Why does it take so long to mine up obsidian? Oh my gosh, it's crazy. So I'm going to re-add the... I've just got a piece of gold. So I don't really know... Does gold work? I know iron and diamonds do. And emeralds. Does gold work? We can go and st snag an emerald from the, the villager like that we've got over, the, over there. <laughs> I think it's that way. I don't, I don't really know where I am in here. Um... So I'm just going to quickly re-add this. Hold on, let me get on here. There we go. Uh, and then I'm going to go and grab some dirt and then basically box the cows into their new farm. I don't really know how big I want it. I just need to create a dirt circle. I need to also see if I can find somewhere a grass block. Um, I don't even know if I've got a grass block. We'll see. Uh, let me go there. that up here is this right yeah that's right okay then we do that then we get oh you can use that okay is this gonna work there we go bit of that and now it is resistance isn't it we need jump boost speed regen so we want resistance There we go. Easy. Okay. Add the dirt back there. There we go. <laughs> that looks good to me. Um, I did actually make this room like completely like perfect. There was no holes in the ceiling. Everything was the same colour block. But just over time, like the amount of people that have come down here to see like actually the beacon room itself and all of that like a few blocks have been broken and stuff but hey ho it is what it is um so i need to go and try and get out there we go i need to go and try and find some form of dirt from somewhere i thought i had some dirt at the end farm but i don't um but yeah i used a total of i'm thinking of i've mined up probably 30 to 30 to 30, basically half a stack of stacks of obsidian if that makes sense. so 32 um roughly stacks of obsidian i've mined up so a hell of a lot i know <laughs> uh right dirt do we have dirt nine 
14. We've got grass blocks. More grass blocks. More grass blocks. More grass blocks. That will do me fine and dandy. Anything else that I'll need? Probably not. Maybe. Who knows? But let's go with this. That's the only thing I could see that I didn't have for the cow farm. Um, so yeah, let's, go, let's, let's head back to the cow farm. Um, and I'm going to give you guys a little bit of a talk on the way. Uh, we, I think this may be the final cut. Because um, so I'll probably try and attempt to do the cow farm. I, I wanted to get the end farm done, but I totally have not. I'm such a failure. But now that like the, the boring, tedious bit is done, I can actually complete the rest on just a live stream. That'll probably take me a live stream now to finish it off. Because you've got to think... I've got the I've got the path like off the you'll see in a second, but I've I've got the path off the 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 four quarters of the um I've not got them off all four quarters, I've only got them off one, obviously. That's where I'm gonna add the cows. And once I've done that and I've got the dimensions, like whatever the dimensions of the cow farm is, that's gonna be the dimensions of the wheat farm, the sugarcane farm, the enchanting place, and we just need to obviously just build that out, build it up, and then just like f flow it with water after hopefully then everything will be working it'll be a self-sustaining sufficient farm because the cows don't only act as a book a, a way to get books but it also acts as a way to get food uh, so because obviously like killing endermen or like constantly like fighting like it does drain your, your hunger and you may not have brought enough food so we can just like use the steak for the food as well and it's just I, it'll, it'll work it'll be good it'll be good to use and hopefully it'll actually work and everyone will be happy with it. I'm hoping everyone will be happy with it. Especially Dave and Jake. Right. So here is the floor. Run around here. And I think that gives it so much more... I don't know. It just gives it something different. And I really like it. It's like a random... I don't know whether people will actually enjoy this. <laughs> They'll definitely like people like Anasia and Maru didn't like the, the looking into the void. We'll definitely like it more. Um, so yeah, that's that's good. That's good. Uh, and hopefully everyone else doesn't like this and think it's a nice idea. I was toying with the idea of adding lava on like the the lowest blocks, but I don't know. I think it'll it's still then deadly because then if you accidentally end a pearl, you might fall through into the lava. You could still die. So it's not really the best there. Right. So this is what we're gonna do with the path off. And then we're going to go from here. I'm probably going to do this out of... I might not do it out of grass blocks. So let's do that, that. That's the staple. Right. How have I messed this up? There we go. That. Then we go. So one more. We could do squares. Like, we could do a square. But obviously, the square, instead of going like that to that, it would just cut across there. Would that work? That could work. That really could work. We're going to do that. Alright, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. That's big enough. Oh, wait, no. That's when I need to start then doing the... Oh, that may actually still be blocks. Who knows? We'll see in a second. I'll just get rid of these just so I can... Just for my own sanity. So I can see what I'm doing. Go so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two. That is the same as that. No, it's not. So now it starts. Is that right? So do we do another one? There we go. Two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine. Is 
Is that right? There we go. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, oh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Spot on. There we go. That's a decent sized farm. It's a decent sized cow farm. I need to knock this guy off. There we go. Right. So we just need to fill this in now and then build the walls and. Oh, God, the walls. I still don't know what I want for the walls. That's the real that's the real issue. The walls is uh, something I have no idea about. The ceiling's easy, it's just gonna be that. The walls I have no idea about. Absolutely no idea. I'll probably build the ceiling now and then we'll just leave the walls till later. I may not move the cows in until the live stream. But this'll this'll work, because then we can have like off, off each corner will have this same this same build uh, obviously not with uh, not with grass on all of them because we'll have the enchanting in one of them and then with the enchanting we can probably I mean the enchanting one will be quite big really too if I'm honest we can probably add like loads of bookcases in there anyway just in general just so it looks a bit nicer I think that's so like a mini library sort of thing Oh my gosh, we may not actually have enough dirt. I thought this would be like way too much dirt. So I need even more for the other bits. This will be a fun live stream though to actually finish all of this. Because we will be able to get this done now. Now that I've got the dimensions of this, this will actually be quite easy to do. And like I say, like, once I've got everything in, like, in each of these corners, I can then build the walls. I'm, not, I'm probably not going to build, as you know, the cows are the ones I need to... I probably need to work on the walls actually then. I'm sure we can work it out and make it look good. We're gonna run out. We're gonna run out. We're gonna like just run out. I can see it. Like a few blocks spare. No it. Four blocks. God damn it. Surely there's four blocks of dirt somewhere. There we go, seven. <laughs> I knew there'd be some. There we go. That looks okay. Um, let me slap the roof on. Do I have any more? I think we've got some more in here. There we go. Holy sweet baby Jesus. Look at them all. I need to knock these off. Book. Is this guy going to go? I'm going to have to fight this guy. Who? Boop. Here we go. I am smart. Oh, I look so good now. Good. Then the Enderman can't spawn in here, which is perfect. Wait, does it go, like, on the outside as well? It does. Ah, poop. I think the outside will be this. The outside will have to be this, then. That'll be fine. That'll be fine. So the outside does need to be these. Oh, so much. go all right so i think i am ready to sign off here we have done now it doesn't seem like a lot of work but it's a long time it's taken me to actually mine up all the 
like that obsidian took me hours to mine up um and then obviously like placing it down making it look right it's taken a while so hopefully you guys have enjoyed that uh nonetheless i hope so <laughs> please see you have otherwise it was a waste <laughs> and let me know what you think of the floor itself like i tried to emulate what carstar one of my twitch mods has done uh well starlet gtt his name is we call him carstar because he's obsessed with cars and he's a mechanic um so hopefully you guys have enjoyed what he did with the i mean i didn't really show you guys but uh he actually like like i said like dug out the very bottom la level of the of the earth and he did the same thing that that but like just left a natural generation of the bedrock and it like it worked really well it looked lovely oh god is he mad no okay uh so yeah hopefully you guys are enjoying this and you actually like this design it's a lot better i think than the um than the void itself it's a lot less dangerous as well which is which is the main actual goal of that um and yeah if you have enjoyed this make sure you leave it a like make sure you leave it a comment subscribe if you're new and as always i'll speak to you all soon take care